Hey everyone, Don here with Don's question of the day. Guys, welcome to your Wednesday's edition of DQOTD. Guys, we'll jump right into today's question of the day, which was, have you ever been a Boy Scout or a Girl Scout? Um, or are you currently one of those things? So I will say real quick on the actual question on Facebook, kind of messed up a little bit. When I was doing the imagery for that and the font, using the font, I had a slash in there for girl, boy, scouts. Um, but unfortunately, the little slash did not appear in the final product. So it was a little confusing today. <laughs> did get some comments, but um, a little confusing with the uh, slash missing. It was like, girls, boy, scouts. I'm like, what? <laughs> so I felt kind of bad about that. I just wanted to clear that up real quick. but. Uh, so I broke it down today, the question, into Girl Scouts, yes and no, and Boy Scouts, yes and no. So we'll get into the Girl Scouts real quick, the results. Um, I had 72% of you say, yes, you had been a Girl Scout, or that you currently are. And 28% uh, said, no, I have not, or have never been a Girl Scout. So 72, 28 on that one. And then the Boy Scouts, I had 46% of you say, Yes, I had been, and 54% um, of you said, no, I've never been a Boy Scout. Um, now, before you go thinking, well, why did the boys have less on the yes? Um, unfortunately, I have more female um, answers uh, that come in on DQOTD. Um, that's just how it is right now until we get a little bit bigger on the subscriptions and the likes and stuff. But uh, it does seem like I have a bigger female audience. So on gender questions and stuff, we can't really go too much or dwell too much into the um, uh, the statistics as far as the gender goes. Um, so because I feel like if I had would have, would have had more boys or men come through, uh, those results might have been a little bit different. So. But the girls definitely had had way more females come in and say they had been a Girl Scout than uh, than no. So, so that's that's awesome. It, it's a good program for both the boys and the girls. Um, you know, it teaches you survival skills and uh, social skills, and teaches you to be responsible for yourself and become a better person and an adult. So, you know, I I, I really think it's a, a good program for both. Um, I never have been in Boy Scouts, um, but I've been in something like it uh, through a church program because my dad was a pastor. So, But that was just for one summer, <laughs> and he was like a leader or something, but there was badges involved and stuff like that. It was, it was pretty fun, so I enjoyed it. But um, just a little facts about the, the Boy Scouts. Uh, they were formed in, uh, it, it was founded in 1910. So it's been around for a long time. Uh, and I don't know exactly on the years and dates on these statistics or these this information. So bear with me on that. 2.4 million members on the Boy Scouts. Now the Girl Scouts had uh, 3.7 million members um, somewhere in this uh, present day situation. I just don't know what the years are. So... Um, it does appear like there is more Girl Scouts than there are Boy Scouts as far as members of the actual um, foundation. So there's there's that. Also, the Girl Scouts was founded two years after the Boy Scouts. I thought it would be a lot longer um, after the Boy Scouts were, were founded, but it wasn't. It was just two years. So that's amazing that it's been around that long. I mean, I'm sure it's not. I'm sure it wasn't like it is today with all the programs and all the things you can accomplish with the with the uh, scouts but still that's that's just amazing it's it's really cool what um, we as America have done with different programs and um, things like that um, yeah <laughs> and you know today they've become what they are and just all these millions of members it's just really cool so that being said, I hope you enjoyed today's question. If you do like what I'm doing with Don's question of the day, please leave me a big fat thumbs up on this video and uh, share DQOTD with your friends. Let them know what we're doing and subscribe to DQOTD on YouTube for more videos just like this one, guys. Appreciate you so much and for the answers today. It was great talking to all of you. Uh, we'll catch you for tomorrow and the fourth question of the week, guys. Bye.